Hey there. Did you see the video where I said what's in the box? <laughs> and I opened a whole lot of boxes. And what was in the big box was this helmet. A showy GT Air 2 or something. And so uh, now that I've, I've been wearing it for a bit, I've done about probably close to a thousand kilometres now with this helmet. Thought I might just, uh, you know what I think? And actually, I think it's pretty good. It's very comfortable, apart from the fact that it squeezes my cheeks. Can you see that? It squeezes my cheeks like my old Auntie Betty used to. Oh, hello darling, you're so beautiful. When I was six years old, I wanted to slap a hand. And when I was 15, I even more wanted to slap a hand. No, just kidding. She was gone by then. Yeah, so it, it squeezes my cheeks a little bit. It's just something I'll have to get used to, and I'm sure, you know, give it six months, and those cheek pads will ease off a little bit. But apart from that, she's as comfy as. I can feel it all around my head, but not not tight, quite comfortable. I can feel it across my forehead, like it's just a, a, a cloth across my forehead. I guess the older helmet was, was higher up. When I came down the other day with Mrs. B, at the end of the, the end of the ride, I could feel that. It wasn't sore, but I could just feel it, you know. It, um, yeah, just something to get used to. Now the integrated intercom, well, I just love that. I'm still getting used to the buttons over here, because some buttons do some things and some buttons do other things, so I um, haven't quite got that all sussed out. I haven't got a camera mounted on it, obviously, as you can see, that's still to come. I haven't, uh, I haven't quite decided what to do with that. I've simply put uh, a stereo microphone in up against the cheek pad, because there seems to be plenty of room there. So I don't even know if this is going to be working, uh, wind noise and all that sort of thing. But we'll give it a go. Um, what else? Let's see if I can make this work. I did the, I did the wrong push of the button. I'm trying to get the music to work. Oh, there it is. Now, I don't know if you're going to hear that. The speakers are made for this helmet. The helmet's made for the speakers. They've got beautiful pockets here that the speakers actually clip into the shell. It's uh, just the right position. Sounds great. Anyway, you can also do voice commands, uh, you can receive and make phone calls. I've got the, I'm able to Bluetooth two devices to it, so I've got my iPod that's got all my music on it, and I've got my phone uh, connected to it as well. Um, so theoretically I can listen to music on the iPod, make and receive phone calls, and send messages through the voice command thing on the phone. The old helmet with the, the Senna 10, was it? I think it was, whatever. Um, had the round button thing and my big fat shoulders, shoulders kept catching that volume button and turning it up, which was annoying the bejesus out of me. The helmet has two vents, one down here and one right up the top. Top one, you turn, open it, and I can certainly feel the, the air coming in. Um, the, top, the bottom one, not so much, but that might be because I'm on this bike. I haven't tried it with the, the Guzzy yet. So maybe with the naked bike, uh, you, you know, you've got that air coming through. Feel it better. What else have we got? Oh, the, uh, the, 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 uh, the pin lock came with it, which I put in, and I haven't had a single bit of fogging since I that. So that's lovely. It's got, um, you open it up and it's got that one sort of click there so you can have the, the visor open one click to, uh, to provide a bit more air. Beautiful. And, you know, you're not supposed to ride like that, but it's got, if I can find it, there it is. It's a, it's a fantastic um, dark, dark visor. You, um, it doesn't change the colour, but it takes out all the glare. It's really good. So, that's me new lid. Oh, it's got emergency 
thing either side to take the cheek pads out for the paramedics if you have a nasty spill uh, so they can get the helmet off without damaging your neck but overall I'm loving this helmet it was a bit expensive but hey I've been riding for 40 years it's just, it's a bigger ride is a, uh, a, a, a treat after all these years Thank you.